Okay, let's get right to it. My uh, first guest, a huge movie star these days. He also continues to be a top comedian. He'll uh, be the headlining act at the MGM Grand in Las Vegas, April 25th through May 8th. He's got a birthday coming up where he'll be 91 years old. Please welcome Don Rickles, ladies and gentlemen. Bunch of owls. Bunch of owls. <laughs> now you look great, gang. This is a smart she she crowd. Look at this guy in his underwear. <laughs> and the guy looked. I got no underwear around. He's on the honeymoon, that guy. I don't care what he's on. <laughs> what the hell do I care what he's on? Let me congratulate you on your wedding anniversary. Was it 51 years you've been barber now? 71. 71 years you've been married. Yeah. And this crowd bought it. Are you crazy? How long have you been married? How many years? I married 31 years to a wonderful woman. She's right now in our bedroom at home going, when is he coming back? <laughs> That's right, boy, when you get a little older, boy. <laughs> Old spider gets busy. <laughs> Old spider? Old spider, yes. Isn't that a cologne? You never met him, how would you know? That's right, Old spider. When the hell did you and I go to a health club together? <laughs> I know when I went. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Well, do something about your body. Look at your body. I've My seen body? him in a shower. The water misses him. <laughs> okay, look at your notes. Jump I'm in. not looking at I'm asking about your anniversary. Say something. When is your anniversary? No, what, there's, something, anniversary? there's some My very insulting things about you. Uh, well, I don't care. I'll get over Where it. Where did you go? Did you take her somewhere? Did you travel? I knew you loved to travel. What do you mean, travel. take her? It's not a dog. I don't walk it. It's a my wife. <laughs> but I take her someplace. Yeah, here, here, Barbara, here. Roll over, here. No, we went down, as a matter of fact, we were on tour with Joan Rivers, my dear friend, and yours. Yes, yes. And Joni and I, and we went down, we were touring, and we were in uh, a place called Me a place. So a Memphis. Place, a place called yeah, Memphis. Yeah, Memphis, Tennessee, where they sit around on the porch going, I'll be damned, there's a bus. <laughs> uh, and on the other side, they go, oh, look at this, Louisa Cricket. <laughs> and uh, she and I were down there, yeah. and uh, we were uh, working at the... Uh, Grand Casino in, in uh, outside of Memphis. Outside? How far outside? What the hell are you from? The travel agency? <laughs> I don't remember casino gambling. Well, who in asked Memphis? you to remember? <laughs> Nobody. What are you? What are you? My guardian? I don't have to tell you where I go. <laughs> Jesus! Forty million Jews. I got to meet a truant officer here. <laughs> so you're down there in Memphis. Did you go so I'm down in yeah. Memphis. That's yeah. right. And we celebrated our anniversary. And we were at the uh, the, the uh, oh gosh, what's the hotel with, with the ducks? Oh, uh, you didn't want my the help a minute ago. The Peabody. <laughs> The Peabody, yeah. The, pe I the roasted duck with the duck in the lobby. No, they don't roast the duck in the yeah. lobby, you dummy. They, they walk they, it through the lobby and then no, they put it on the That's right. The ducks come out of they, they're up on the top floor and they come down. What am I talking about? I don't care about the ducks. I got my own troubles for that. Anyway, so the wife and I are sitting there and yeah. Joan Rivers and her all big, we're having a big dinner and the guys come with the flaming this and the flaming that. <coughs> Mr. Rickles, it's a wonderful anniversary. And a guy leans over and says, Mr. Rickles, all of a sudden we hear, bang, 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 bang. And I've been in enough hotels, as a lot of us have been. I said, that's ah, probably, you know, a rehearsal or they're just checking the alarm system. The guy said, we're just checking, Mr. Riggles, no problem. And now we get to the main course and the guy leans over. He says, uh, Mr. Riggles, you'll have to evacuate. There's a fire. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we all got up and we went outside. And as we were going outside, I, may I stand up? As, may I stand up? What, what uh, is it, San yes, Quentin? Yes, you may. Yeah. I'm like, uh, anyway, so I, I, I get up and there's, there's the fireman walking by with a hose, big hose, helmet, the oxygen tank, he walks by. And he does one of these. Hey, hey, what are you doing in town? <laughs> swear to God, I swear to God. I said, well, uh, uh, I'm here for, never mind that, there's a fire. Don't worry about it. How, how, how? I swear, how, how, how long are you gonna be here? I said, will you get upstairs and put out the fire? He said, why, what are you worried? Meanwhile, the lobby's got a little smoke and he gives me one of these. <laughs> <laughs> Fire. 
<laughs> nah, it's nothing. Every fire they call it a grease fire, you know. Yeah. And some guys in the kitchen going, some Mexican kids running around going, I didn't do it. They're crying out loud, I didn't do it. <laughs> a Mexican kid said that. There's nothing bad about that. <laughs> Where the hell am I working? Ellis Island? <laughs> Did you get a chance to go to uh, Graceland, Elvis' home? Did yeah. You yeah. He's, he's alive, you know. Really? Yeah. Yes, yes. I saw him in the back of the house smoking a cigarette. Boom, 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 boom. Anyway, well, we went to Graceland, and it's great. The, 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 the rooms are decorated in early paint. Yeah. Uh, uh, <coughs> Jeez, and now I'm going to get sick. <laughs> God almighty, get, get, get yourself an injection or something for crying out loud. <laughs> Need this. I was a healthy Jew. I come out here, I can see when the show's over, I'm gonna be in a hospital going, <laughs> it was Jay Leno. <laughs> so uh, I went over to Elvis Presley's place, and it's, you know, the mansion and so right. forth. And they all stay, they have fanatic fans, you know. Big fans. Can't make jokes, which I did, you know. I said, Elvis is alive. The guy went, he is not, he's dead. I said, no, the guy's alive. You know something I don't know? All of a sudden I had him convinced he was alive, so they all started to follow me. <laughs> well, we went on a private tour. Joan Rivers was with us, and we had a lot of laughs. and. We looked around, we saw his plane, and we you know, saw the house. Did you ever meet him? Did you ever Yes. Him? Yes, yes. Met him at the Riviera in Las Vegas a lot of years ago, and he came backstage and said to me, Hi, Don, I'm Elvis Presley. Like, I didn't know. He had the wings on, and he was flying around. And <laughs> had the mustache and the sideburns were locking up his neck. And in fact, uh, in fact, he gave me uh, one of those, uh, you know, he's got a lightning bolt. Is the, uh, a lightning bolt? Yeah. What do I have to, is this a playback? <laughs> He's got a what, the, what the hell's the matter? Everything I say, I get the feeling I got a problem. I'm He's okay. like a pin. Can you hear him? It's the guy here in the front. Snap out of it, huh? <laughs> An old guy right in the front going, what a night, what a night. <laughs> so, uh... You don't have to be that attentive. I'm listening. <laughs> no, you don't have to give me I one of these. I find this fascinating. I get the feeling. You remind me of no, one no. of these doctors. No, in talk show school, I they teach you to do this. I see by your chart you have uh, cancer. <laughs> okay, you come in Friday for the wonderful uh, polynoscopy, and then we'll uh, check out the rest. I'm going to play golf. Anyway, so uh, that was a little doctor bit. I Dr. throw those things good, in because good. you have been much of a help tonight. Yeah, You're yeah. sitting there like you got the job. Well, let me ask you about you. Let me... <laughs> Let me ask you about your other famous. I know you have a lot of famous Hollywood friends. I saw you at the Clint Eastwood dinner. What was that? The American film the, um, something? AFI dinner? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I you was go very... to every dinner, I know. Well, sure. Hey, you know, you got to get a hot meal once yeah. in a while, you know. I could be with and you, you but I don't, I don't like yeah. to live in Johnny Rockets, you know, no. hanging around you, you know. You ever hang out with him and his wife? <laughs> Two burgers to go. <laughs> I mean, I go, I go class. You know, yeah. we go to a big restaurant. Yeah. You can't handle that. No, no. Newhart I'm not, I'm told not a me about guy. Newhart told me about that with you. You know, Newhart and I went had a lovely meal. Yeah, well, sure. You and him are perfect. You know, two of you would just sit there and watch the waiter die. <laughs> uh, two of them, a lot of fun. Huh? What well, do you want to do? Tell me about Clint Eastwood. Tell me about your famous okay. Hollywood pals. Don't beg. I'll tell you. Don't beg. <laughs> Well, Clint was uh, wonderful. He, he got married, you know. Yeah. <laughs> He'll be very happy. <laughs> but, uh, no, I wish him the best. He's great. He's like De Niro, the two of them. You know, you sit in a room with the two of them, and they go, they, this is the two of them talking. <laughs> and like a jerk, you go, huh? <laughs> and the whole night, because they're big stars, you've got to make out like you understand them. Like you and I. I think, yeah, well, no. You, you're a dynamite guy. Your wife. Your wife is the thing that saves you. He's got a lovely wife, She's Mavis. A beautiful wife. She's a great wife. She really is. Wonderful wife. Do you know Roberto Benigni? Well, she's not, she's not that great. Let's not get crazy. I mean... Do you know Roberto Benigni? Have you ever met him? I met him backstage. He Wonderful guy. Yeah, he's sitting there. He got oil all over my suit. <laughs> he's making pasta or something. He got oil all over, all over me. I couldn't, you know. I said, hello, Roberto. Hello, Don. How are you? And he started rubbing all over me. We'll be right back with <laughs> Roberto Benigni right after this. Don Rickles! Thank you.